Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Y'all, today I have like a different video for y'all. It's a, a challenge for me. Um, this is the Dollar Tree $5 meal challenge. So, I'm going to pray y'all and then I'm going to get into whatever, it, what, what all this is, what I'm doing and all that. So, all right, so. What I did, y'all, let me go ahead and shout out Courtney, y'all. She helped me. That's my friend. She helped me um, kind of come up with this challenge. So, y'all, she kept telling me to shout her out. So, I'm going to shout her out. Um, anyway, so what I have is some barbecue chips here. And then I have some Texas toast. And, y'all, I got these beef patties. All this is from Dollar Tree. Um, and, yeah, so let me show y'all. It's it's hot. I just It just came off the, out of the pan. The toast, though, I couldn't get it to get, like, crunchy, y'all. So I don't know about that. I have some mayo off to the side. It's not from Dollar Tree. Um, if you want to add like some condiments, some seasoning, because I seasoned up this meat, um, you can do that. I'm probably not going to eat both of these. I hope I like it. Like, please don't let this be a fail. Okay. I ain't got time for that. Um, anyway, I'm going to take a bite real quick. Oh, I'm scared. Because this meat, y'all, I could not get it. Like, this how it's done, but I like it a little darker. But I could not get it to like get how I wanted it, if that makes sense. I could not get it like that. So I'm gonna I'm gonna see. And this in this bread, I like my garlic bread to be like a little crunchy, but I could not get it to be crunchy for for nothing. I went ahead and took it out of the oven though because I didn't want it to burn. Um I'm not gonna add anything on it right now, but I think I'm gonna have to add some mayo to it. So oh. Okay, I'm about to do it. I'm about to do it. My ass meal. Okay. It's actually like it's not horrible. And real quick, ain't nothing wrong with you know, cause I shop at Dollar Tree, but I just don't get my meat from Dollar Tree. I just don't get my meat from there. But instead of regular bread, cause I thought they didn't sell bread, but I think they do. But I knew they sold um, garlic bread, so I'm like, I'm just gonna use that as my bread. But when I went, I didn't see any regular bread. I was using garlic bread um, anyway, so. But that actually don't taste bad. It kind of tastes like the school patty. I didn't tell what I had to drink. Sprite. But yeah, it tastes like a, it tastes like a school patty. And I probably won't eat all these chips. Y'all, it's like the whole bag. I just poured it on here for the plate. <laughs> but it's not bad. Let me get into it again with the mayo on it. Can y'all see that thing? It's really not bad, y'all. <laughs> I'm shook. I'm shook. Mmm. See, if y'all are balling on the budget, go to Dollar Tree. They have, like, all sorts of stuff. Like, even name brand stuff you can get at Walmart. They have it there. Of course, it's, like, the smaller um, size, but it's for a dollar. So... Let me tell you about the challenge. You make a meal with five dollars or under. Um, this was three dollars. The chips, the bread, and the meat. Like I said, this is from home. It was in the fridge. Mayo. Um, so it's not included. But yeah. Um, the main thing, like your main meal items, need need to come from Dollar Tree. I don't expect anybody like to do the challenge, but if you want to, that's cool. You know, please do. Um, but it's just something I thought would be fun uh, for my for my um, video, for my page. So I was talking to my friend and came up with this. So I'm glad I'm I'm glad I'm doing it. I'll probably do like um, more videos like this because I like I like doing stuff like this. Look at this. It don't see it don't look bad. Look at the inside. Now the meat it reminds me of like school. Hamburger patties, the inside and stuff, because like it got like that rubbery type of look. Now it don't taste rubbery, and it don't taste like a like a ground beef like you would get from Walmart or like Publix or whatever. But it's not bad. 
But the garlic bread, though, I'm about to do that on the regular. I think I might do this again. I'm going to see, like, how many meals I can make. I know it's not talking with my hands, but I want to see how many meals I can make from Dollar Tree. Pinkies up. <laughs> but yeah, I want to talk to y'all about something. Like, I've been seeing on, I don't know why I picked that up and put it down, but something I've been seeing on social media. Y'all, um, let me know what y'all think. I was watching Damon Mile, and they were talking about, like, Lil Nas X video. It has something to do with that, but it's not really of the video um, itself, so. All y'all know, Cardi B and Megan Thee Stallion got a song called Wop Out. And then y'all know about Lil Nas, he just dropped that video. Um, and that shoe and all. I'm not really gonna get into, like, that, what I think of if it's like video or anything like that. But a lot of people are mad because like Megan and Cardi um Megan and Cardi Francis, um, the song Wall. A lot of parents are mad because the song is like they say it's inappropriate for kids and like Lil Nas A's like that's inappropriate for kids and the thing is y'all, why y'all can't be thinking celebrities are gonna cater to your children, especially ones that are in the rap business and in the you know, do trap music and nasty music, whatever the thing is, they've been doing videos like this, so they never <laughs> make music for kids. I don't see why it was a big, like, deal, especially with the Grammys. I think they performed WAP on the Grammys. A lot of parents are mad about that. Now, what kid watches the Grammys? <laughs> I mean, maybe they're maybe they watching it as a family. I never watched the, the Grammys as a kid. Maybe people do. Mm-hmm, but... Maybe kids watch the Grammys, but if you know, they saying, um, Cardi B, Megan, about to perform. I mean, turn your TV off, mute it, change the channel, have some discussion, whatever the case, but we gotta start thinking like, they're gonna cater to your music needs. Like they're not, they're not gospel singers, you know. They're not kid-friendly artists. Most of their music is not, especially making the sound. Y'all know she made all kind of music with like inappropriate language, vulgar language, cussing, whatever. However you want to put it, she's been making music like that. Cardi B too. Like there's nothing new. I know a walk like a um, few weeks back. A, a lot of people were like. Y'all let y'all kids listen to WAP. You know, and things like, you kids shouldn't be listening to that. Cardi B, doesn't, like, she don't even let her kids, like, listen to that. She don't make music for children. So, I don't get where people, I don't get where people are, are going with that concept. Y'all shouldn't be letting your kids listen to it in the first place. Like, if you, you know, knowing they, they talk like that. Just like, take another bite. Mm, mm, pretty good. Just like, you know. You got, like, Tank out here. He makes, you know, a lot of music that's, like, nasty. You got a lot of, a lot of like, men artists that do it. And, you know, some people are saying it's because they're female. Um, A lot of kids look up to them, which that can be true. I know, I understand where they're coming from with that point. Like, children look up to a lot of celebrities, but still... You know what type of music they make, so you should be mad when they come out with a song like WAP. Like, I don't I don't know. I don't get it. But celebrity, like, people in the music industry who make music like that from the get-go, they're not going to cater, you know, to, to, you know, fit it for children if they don't make children's music in the first place. I don't see why. I just don't see what the hype was about, you know, about the song, but... And that's really my take on that. This meat, though, I seasoned it, but I feel like it needs more seasoning because it tastes kind of bland. It tastes kind of bland. The, the garlic bread is like bringing in more flavor because this, um, this is Texas toast, but it's garlic parmesan Texas toast, I believe. So, like I said, I think I'm going to try another, another thing like this. Like, what y'all think? Oh, 
Oh, it's making my ear itch. I got all these barbecue chips on here. No, I ain't gonna eat them all right now. Oh. Oh. Was it the seasoning or just this beef making my ear itch? <laughs> oh, no. My ear's going crazy. But, what meal should I try next from there? That can be $5 or under. Because this time I'm going to finish this one. Well, mm -mm, this one? Mm -mm. And then it's a dollar, so calm down. <laughs> Look at the inside. This one tastes like um, real, I guess you can say. I pray that my stomach be okay, okay? These chips are good. It's probably gonna be a short video, y'all. Um, but like I said, this if you want to um, do it, please go ahead. But I just thought it would be something fun to do on here. Because I'm never, never done like this. None, I'm never done eating it like this. i um, never had their meat. So like, you can see the, let me show you this patty. I don't know if I, did I show you the patty? You can see like the garlic and stuff on top of it. But yeah. It ain't something that I would just buy again and have like for dinner. Unless I had to. Now if I had to, I would. But, mm -mm. I'm gonna go ahead and finish this patty off though, because I don't have much left. I feel like it's gonna make my stomach hurt, y'all. I'm not sure. <laughs> I don't know why. It just, like, it just tastes like I said, it tastes like fake. Well, it's not bad. Mmm. Mm -mm -mm. These barbecue chips, they roll up. They salty. Oh, I'm really just... Oh, mm -mm. <laughs> I don't know. That's nothing but flavor in my mouth. Mm -mm. I said, it's going to be a short video, y'all. I'm going to get on here and try it. <clears throat> like I say every video check my description box y'all add me on my social media well, all my social media um hope y'all enjoy this video if you want to try it please try it if you have any ideas of what y'all want me to try next like if you know what Dollar Tree has I'm not sure of everything they have um meal wise for $5 and under let me know in the comments I hope y'all enjoy this video y'all stay safe stay blessed and I'm going to see y'all with another video. Bye, y'all.